Hello, everybody. Welcome back. Welcome back to Trivia Night. We are going to be starting Chapter 2. We have Army... Now what? Now what indeed? So, um, if you were unaware of what happened last time, A, go check out the other two videos. It's like a half hour for both of them. Together. Um, because you will not understand Army. You will not understand Omni. Um, a brand new, same old day. Having narrowly escaped certain death with your best friend Omni, you, Cherry, and Wanda are barricaded inside the sex story of Zed's bar. Things look grim, but through the power of friendship, no difficulty is insurmountable. All it takes is a little elbow grease, a few hard knocks, and the willingness to sacrifice just about anyone and everyone else to make sure you keep on keeping on. I love this. This is great. Um, what I might do... Uh, for one of these that requires a new character is make the character I'm planning to play for the next series or the next for the DLC if I can even they're completely unreasonable to believe this juice box is following you and yet you weren't in here last time why not open it it's locked stupid it's not a stupid question you're a stupid question anyway you can't break that window Oh, yes, I do. I've been trying to break that window for years. Bricks, bullets, I once such a ju stole a jug of hydrochloric acid and tried to melt the window. Nothing works. It's like some so kind of super window. Stupid-ass super windows. I know, right? And there's also a spoiler in the last episode for how we escape. I guess I was wrong. He actually made it. Did you used to being wrong? This room looks different. It's bigger. I don't know what you mean, and I don't know how that matters. You ever notice how the insides of buildings are usually way bigger than the outsides? <laughs> no, I've never noticed this. I'm beginning to resent myself for engaging you in this conversation. I mean, I guess it makes sense. We live in a world where magic is real. And they did stuff like that in Harry Potter. Who's Harry Potter? No idea. Hey, you know what? I said, hey, you know what? I heard you. Then why did you say anything? It's really rude. Anyway, I was thinking this would be a perfect time for a flashback. <gasps> oh. Um, those things are down there doing God knows what. We do not have time for a flashback. Well, it's too late. Camera's already fading out. <gasps> Cam- God damn it! What camera? Nothing's fa- Oh, wait. How about now? Still nothing. I'm done talking to you. How about now? Hey, lady. What's your name again? Wanda. Ain't you Cherry Poppins? Cherry Crush. Hey. I guess we're going to have to figure out this out ourselves, because this Joker ain't no help. Probably the worst person I've ever met. You see, he's, ain't you see the, he carry an arm around? So nasty. How about now? What's he talking about? Do you really want to know? Yeah, good point. Ladies, you're, you're really starting to hurt my feeling. Hey, look, there it goes. Finally. <laughs> oh, I love this. This is so great. The flashback that never was. The Shadowrun Academy is the most prestigious Shadowrunner preparation school in the country. Though a few generous donations, through a few generations, you were able to get on a waiting list. And when a potential student mysteriously lost his leg in a tragic magic show accident at your 18th birthday, you found yourself an SRA student, underachieving like only you can. Today's lecture is being conducted by the star student, Brock Simmons. <gasps> Brock Simmons. Not Brock Sampson. I hope it's a Brock... Oh. Thank you, Brock, for that excellent report on escaping from second-story buildings. I especially love the di diorama of a CD bar and three survivors trapped upstairs with zombie downstairs. Very informative. <gasps> Thank you, Professor Shadowrun. I spent hours on it instead of attending to my personal life. I want to be the best Shadowrunner this school has ever seen. Why am I here? Shh, I'm trying to learn. You know there's no such thing as a Shadowrun Academy, right? Oh yeah? Then why is there one in my flashback? Why do you even- Why do you keep coming to the bar on Thursdays for Trivia Night when you know for a fact we don't do that? What bar? Remember? This is my past self. I haven't st started coming to the bar yet. I can't even begin to understand you. Silence, please. I'm still praising Brock, and I don't like to be interrupted. Now where was I? Yes. Your shooting is flawless. Your body honed to the point that the great sculptors old wish they lived to see it so they could immortalize you in marble. I feel like deep this daydream is <laughs> straying into some strange territory. <laughs> this is a flashback, not a daydream. Now will you please be quiet? Time for lunch. They're making sloppy joes today. Professor Shadowrun. 
something I can help you with? I know I'm no Brock, but... What do you think of me? You know, but I know I exactly said that. Especially for the day around. Is there an ultimate? What about starting a fire? Yes. But if you do have an exit, I'll probably keep that in mind. I was hoping a little extra credit. Would you like to hear my proposal? I do a project like Brock's, but instead, instead of how to escape from a difficult situation, I could teach class how to get into a situation. <laughs> so they can escape. I don't know, why don't you tell me? Why don't you tell me? Why don't you tell me? Who's questioning who here? Whom? Who's questioning whom? No, nothing. Why do you even come talk to me? It's just weird. I like to, if I could do the accent, this guy would be voiced by Stomper. Stomper TV. Why do you even come talk to me? That's just weird. Jerry Crush? What you doing? Aren't you still trapped with Rumi? No, yeah, not really sure. Maybe my subconscious is trying to tell me something. Rational side of you died long ago, so I guess that theory is just as good as any. Just figure it out. I'm pretty sure the real me doesn't want to die. The real me does And she wants me. Bad. Your subconscious wanted me, want me to know that Cherry doesn't want you. At all. Barring a lobotomy, she never will. So all it will take is a lobotomy. I can see I've made a mistake here. If I get the chance to give her a lobotomy, I totally am. Ooh, something right across the street door, the hallway. <gasps> Army! Armly, I mean. Armly, can you speak? I guess I can. Here. Then I never want to leave. But you have to. Otherwise, we'll both die. But we're happy here. I know. And we'll be happy again. There are many things you must do. First, things you must see. I love you, Armly. Goodbye, my friend. No! Armly! God, what am I playing? Flashback in a flashback. Usually people just have one flashback and call it a day. I mean, the same flashback cuts up, cut up into several different samplings. Not you, though. You have flashbacks within flashbacks. While the undead are waiting to consume you. This can't be a good thing, can it? Did, who are you? Wait, wouldn't I, wouldn't I really have no idea what's going on at this point. A flashback within a flashback? If he says flashbackception, that can't be good. I'm relieving really scenarios. Also, I've really like to... I feel my recall accuracy might be somewhere in the low teens. <laughs> I hear that. Yeah? Yeah. So, yeah. Well, see ya. Later. What is my life? Ooh. I didn't even know that button existed. Armly! Armly! Armly, I found you. Why aren't you speaking? No, Armly, please come back. Please. Answer me. I'll just wait here then. Until then. With you. What is my life? There and back again. Really, this room is quite a lot bigger with virtually no explanation. Also, a lot of the props have changed. A drum set got added? It's just begging to be played, and as soon as... You start playing it, you know just all the zombies are going to come up and want to turn two. I agree. So I need to set a fire in this room, right? Right. Okay. Are you, are, do you have different stuff going on now? No. Cherry Crush, what's up? What's up, baby? What are you doing? What do you, what do you mean? Don't, don't you remember? I can't believe you don't remember my flashback. You were there. Armly was there. And me? Of course. You were a prostitute. <laughs> That's fair. I vote for Wanda. One of you has to have sex with me before I die. I'm intrigued. <laughs> Okay, so I apparently have to go downstairs. 
That's okay, I've got amazing skills, so... Ah. Yes. I've got, I've got amazing skills that will pay bills. What the hell do you have to do everything all the time? This is getting ridiculous. Why don't you cherry hate you? They've said as much many, many times. Pretty much any chance they get. So why do you keep doing crap for them, huh? Next time, one of them has to run through the pit of zombies and get the keys out of the skull or whatever stupid thing that needs doing. This is, is utter bullshit. <laughs> I love this game. Why can I talk with this guy? Zombie boss. Okay, this room is definitely bigger. Renovations. Setting up shop. That's industrious. I do have one question, though. Are you going to do a trivia night? You're a damn fool. Think of all the revenue you'll lose. I see it's not just your body that has died, but also your soul. Oh. Bam. Bam. Dead. Oh, hello. Who are you? Thank you for dying. Yep, you miss. Bam. Yep, you're dead. Hey, can I not look at the strange dead girl? Apparently not. I got Zetskis. They've. Pr I bet they've broken out already. How much you want to bet they've broken out already? Through the window. Really, this room is a lot, quite a lot bigger. Oh, yeah, I've. Yep. Got that already. Which means they should be right there. Maybe I want to look around a bit first. Let's open this door. Normal rug. Yeah, it seems to tie the whole room together. I got a lighter and some cloth. A lighter, a fuse, add it to the barrel in the corner. Um, I want to. I want to set a freaking fire. How? Why can't I set this thing on fire? Okay, I guess I can't set it on fire. I'm upset, game maker. Confirm. <laughs> you go back and forth on whether or whether or not you meant to land on Wanda. Whatever, the point is she dropped down first, and then when you came down, you ended up on top of her. Now she's complaining about her thigh or something. Some part of her leg. Whatever. She, if she keeps yelling, though, she might draw attention to your small, intrepid band of survivors. <sighs> what a whiner. Okay. And... All in all, uh, after this, yeah, you fucking fell on me, you asshole. Damn it, Wanda, can you walk? Hell, no, hell no. Oh, it hurts so bad. I can't. Even... Her language has gotten much nicer as well. Such your. Never mind. <laughs> I could carry her. But I don't know. I, then I'd be all tired and sweaty. Maybe there's another way. I know what I must do. From satchel you carry all the time, you draw out three small orbs. One red, the color of fire. One blue, the color of water. One brown, the color of earth. Have you been messing around with my air ball? What? I can't find my air ball. Firefighter burns brighter the longer it fights. Craftiness and combos will win the day with Aqualung! I only know these two. Um... Earth Zor. Um, we're gonna go with fire. <laughs> Flickering Flist. Oh my god, it's like Pokemon. Um. Burning Bolt. Flickering fist. Hey, okay. use burning bolt.
Why does it have 13 out of 12 HP? I'm confused. Oh, okay. Fire fighter starring Drew Barrymore. I always fight fire with fire. Actually, I'm willing to fight just about anything with fire. Back to your ball, firefighter starting Drew Barrymore. I'm playing Pokemon in Shadowrun. I'm confused. Um, I... Oh, I did this before, after the save. Okay. What do you mean? Don't be silly. I'll always carry this bag. Always. Three... These monster and slave balls. Or, man, can we, Ooh. I don't know, actually. I doubt it. I said. Be careful with him. I can hear you. Whatever. Bye-bye, whiny prostitute. Litter. Not even ten feet from the trash can. Jerk. Okay, yep. Yeah. Come on! I can hear you. Yes, yes. Bye-bye, whiny prostitute. Okay. Um, actually... There? Yes, there. This is where we're gonna end the episode. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, all that great stuff. Then you'll be able to see where this continues on to. Yeah, I'm excited. It's Pokemon now. <laughs> I'll see you next time. Adios.